So this is going to be a quick update. They just rolled out a hot fix for Remnant 2 for the Awakened King since it was having a lot of problems yesterday. A lot of players weren't able to play, start the game, all kinds of stuff. So we're going to read off the major ones. So this is it. So if you are on Epic, fix an issue where purchase DLC was not verifying ownership, thus not showing the content in the game. So if you're on Epic, um, this should fix your DLC problems. Now this is a bug that they fixed for PlayStation 5. Fix an issue preventing some players from joining friends games. So I guess you couldn't play your friends yesterday on PlayStation 5. That kind of sucks. And a big one, fix an issue where the cube gun would cause a crash while fighting the Blade of the King. Sounds kind of bad. Let's read up the next major one. Fix an issue where the Energize neck coil would apply damage with every application of status effects. Now, I was playing around with the new class that they added in, and I was using this build that had the neck coil on it, and I noticed it was doing a lot of damage. Like, I was just wiping out rooms and destroying everything, and I thought the class was just really good, but apparently it, it was a bug. But, you know, it is what it is. Now, here's another big one. Fix an issue where the Forgotten were doing too much damage. Now, I believe that the new enemies that they added in, uh, like the green guys that, that hang out on the walls and throw stuff at you, I think those are the people they're talking about because they were two-shotting me with 60 plus DR and uh, like 250 armor. I was getting just getting two-shotted in full heavy armor. So I think that was definitely too much damage. I was playing on veteran, by the way, like where anybody says apocalypse. It was veteran and they were just destroying me. So hopefully that's fixed and a uh, pretty quick update. Not too many crazy bugs this hot fix. So hopefully they keep it up and we'll see you on the next one.